APIX 21.2 introduces pagination support for simple HTTP resources. APIX can therefore automatically execute multiple HTTP requests to fetch all requested data from the REST service. In this demo, let's take a look at the GitHub repository API for database example commits. I'm just copying the API URL and then I go to my APEX 21.2 environment. In my application, I go to Shared Components, REST Data Sources, click Create from scratch, enter a name, paste the order endpoint here, then click Next. Click Next again. Now here is the new feature in Apex 21.2. Before Apex 21.2, when you choose simple HTTPP, there is no pagination. But now you have three different options to choose from. You have page size and fetch offset, you have page size and page number, and page number. For GitHub API, we choose page size and page number. You can also click the online help to understand what each parameter is about. GitHub has a page size URL parameter. This is per page. And for GitHub API, page size maximum is 100. For page number URL parameter, enter page. And accept the default for index of first page, which is 1. And for some of the other APIs, you can also enter details for has more row selector and total row selector. We don't have this information for GitHub API, so let's click next. There is no authentication required. Let's click discover and now click create REST data source. We now want to see how the pagination works. So let's do some synchronization to the local table. Let's click the REST data source name. And here you see manage synchronization. Click this. Let's enter a name for the local table and click save. The synchronization table does not exist at the moment. So let's click create table. And now click save and run. The job status shows running and if you scroll down you can see that there are 9 history people requests that were made and 862 rows that are synchronized to the local table. Let's click the log. Because of the configuration we just made Apex transparently executes pages 1, 2, 3 until page 9. Now let's take a look at the SQL workshop and navigate to the table to understand how many repository commits we have on the database examples repository. Let's click this and then let's go to SQL workshop, view in SQL workshop. Click data and we see this is all real data. We want to know how many repository commits we have on the database examples repository. Let's click count rows and choose 862 rows. In this demo, you learn how to utilize the out-of-the-box declarative pagination support for simple HTTP REST data sources introduced in Apex 21.2. Thank you for watching this video.